Sum that up, you start with. Disappointing to be honest. Uh, I know that people talk about Dublin as some sort of superpower, but I'll be honest, we come down here as a team we were quite the confident. I was quite the confident. Uh, whenever we had a poor first half, I'll be honest, we come in, we talked about it, we felt we were over all a wee bit. We said our aim at half time was to be ten minutes to go, uh, keep it two or three points, spend the game with that and then yeah. try and kick on from there and give ourselves a fighting chance, to be honest. We didn't do it like do you think you're maybe guilty of playing the jersey rather than playing the game? No, I well, also don't think so. Uh, silly mistakes, you know, when boys mm-hmm. look at the sales, like, I for one was the same and everybody else thought, like, we were breaking out all right. And then next thing we got to either 45 and round their D and a fist in the ball and all of a sudden the dumb player coming yeah. over, fit to get it. Stuff we wasn't doing too. A fist in the ball and it hitting the ground, which gives a man a chance to get, in and get a tackle on. You know, simple stuff, you know, that county level you just don't do we were doing it and maybe boys were a bit overawed but I suppose that's experience that we're better off for and all that you had a few goal chances as well that might have made it look a bit better do you think they had I, a part to play well I suppose if, if we had no luck going to the end of the day like, they had a couple of goal chances but theirs were under pressure mm. you know, we were putting them under pressure in the tackle supposed to be the many good saves I hit one and I had it as sweet as you could have hit <laughs> Beat the keeper, and on another day, if I'd have scuffed that, I'd have put it on the net. But having the man stand on the line, you know nothing about it, like so. I suppose that summed up our day in there. Yeah, but it's just before half time, they tried to fist across the goals. Uh, pure again, game. he could have shot the ball one over. Yes, again, that was that was vindictive of our whole game, like fisting the ball. And I said, a Dublin man come out of nowhere and just intercepted the ball, you know. Wherever we were doing it, too, we always fist the ball to the chest. That one was a wee bit high, and man was able to get an intercept it. Uh, but I suppose that games, games didn't turn, turn on that chance alone, but I would have left us four up before we get the goal, like, but even, even the point where it six down. But as I say, we started off not too bad in the start mm. of the second half, we kicked on, got the first couple of scores, but as I say, overall, like, I'm pretty disappointed to be honest. That would have given you, as you didn't know before, an idea of what you have to at least try to reach to be competitive when you go step up. But Aye, it's the first, to be honest, the first massive setback we've had this year. So I suppose it's a test of boys' character. If nothing else, uh, people like to say our fitness called in the question. You know, we are still going at the end of the game. It was silly mistakes that they tied on with the year one four through our mistakes again, and you know it's just more or less playground stuff, and that's that's what makes it so disappointing. Like, Dunny Goldberg, they, they were very poor as well, I don't know you saw it, but we didn't see it anything. I've seen the first 20 minutes, you know, and it looked as if now, to be honest, Dunny Goldberg, they reverted the tight. I was sitting around the halfway line and they seen they got a lot of men behind the ball and break it piece again. Probably stuff they weren't doing in the league because most of their league games was finishing 218 to 213, something like ours, but we're playing the four weeks a day and it's 25th and we know it's going to come down to a real dog of the fair again. And and the Aussie Championship teams might change their style of football again and kind of revert the type, you know, so. Do you think Christian Donegal looked very sluggish as a heavy training and hadn't yet produced well, the end result? I, again, Donegal's just home from the Algarve or wherever home from. They probably did have a heavy seven, seven or eight days. But they'd be going to Algarve with us in mind. They wouldn't have been preparing for the Monaghan game. I'll be honest, since, since we beat Kildare and we knew we were qualified or safe even in our division, we have one eye in Donegal, like not any different. Uh, mm. We were playing the league out. We set ourselves a new goal after every game, after we got to the Kildare game for the semi final. We, we set ourselves to qualify for the final. We've done that, so we're trying to kick on from there and we'll set ourselves a new goal come Thursday night. We're out again with club games on Wednesday, so we're out again on Thursday. Will it be difficult to lift the as I said, that's the first big set, setback of the year? Uh, I suppose you learn every day. Psychologically now, you boys are getting a bit more experience. Uh, I know we'll be disappointed for two or three or four days, boys, and that's just how it is. But if you're going to compete at this level, you have to be able to put stuff like that behind you and learn from it. Uh, boys will home at night, and I know for one, I'll not, and I know the rest of the boys will I'll toss and turn all night. You know, sleep, you wake up tomorrow, and you'll be thinking about it, and I suppose that's where it sinks in wherever you're by yourself, and you're at home, and you think about the game. You might take a look at it over the next couple of days and see if you can improve on personally as a team and we'll not get together the Thursday night again, we'll sit down and set ourselves new goals like, but the next two or three days with recovery because we've club games on Wednesday and so when you're playing out there, come back to play a club game on Wednesday, back out Thursday like, and probably we've done a lot of work to get to this stage and it'd be an awful shame if we've if we seen this as the end of something, which we don't. So.
Super here. 